Ancient Sumer was one of the earliest civilizations in the world, located in Mesopotamia, which is now modern-day Iraq. The Sumerians believed in a complex system of religion and mythology that was central to their society, politics, and daily lives. The Sumerian pantheon of gods was vast and complex, and it evolved over time as the Sumerians encountered other cultures and assimilated their beliefs. In this essay, we will explore the religion and mythology of ancient Sumer, focusing on the pantheon of gods. Historical Context The Sumerians were one of the earliest urban civilizations in the world, and they developed a complex system of government, agriculture, and trade. They lived in a fertile region between the Tigris and Euphrates rivers, which allowed them to develop a thriving agriculture-based economy. This led to the emergence of cities and city-states, each with its own ruler and temple. The Sumerians believed that the gods had given them the land, and they felt a strong obligation to worship and honor the gods in return. This led to the development of a complex system of religion and mythology, which was central to their society. The Sumerian Pantheon the Sumerian pantheon was complex and evolved over time as the Sumerians encountered other cultures and assimilated their beliefs. The gods were often grouped into families or pantheons, and each god had a specific role or function. Some of the most important gods in the Sumerian pantheon included Anu the god of the sky and king of the gods. Anu was worshipped in the city of Uruk, and he was often depicted as a bull or a human with horns. Enlil, the god of the wind and storms. Enlil was worshipped in the city of Nippur, and he was often depicted as a bearded man holding a staff. Enki, the god of wisdom and water. Enki was worshipped in the city of Eridu, and he was often depicted as a bearded man with a flowing beard. Enanna, the goddess of love, fertility, and war. Enanna was worshipped in the city of Uruk, and she was often depicted as a young woman with wings. Ninhursag, the goddess of the earth and fertility. Ninhursag was worshipped in the city of Kish, and she was often depicted as a woman with a horned headdress. Yutu, the god of the sun and justice. Yutu was worshipped in the city of Larsa, and he was often depicted as a man with a sun disc on his head. Nana, the god of the moon. Nana was worshipped in the city of Uar, and he was often depicted as a man with a crescent moon on his head. These were just a few of the many gods and goddesses in the Sumerian pantheon. Each god had a specific role or function, and they were often associated with specific cities or regions. Mythology The Sumerians had a rich mythology that was intertwined with their religion. Myths were often used to explain natural phenomena, such as the changing of the seasons or the movement of the stars. They were also used to explain the origins of the gods and the creation of the world. One of the most important myths in Sumerian mythology was the Enuma Elish, which was the creation myth of the Babylonians. It tells the story of how the god Marduk defeated the monster Tiamat and created the world from her body. The Enuma Elish was a complex myth that had many layers and was subject to interpretation. It served to justify the rule of the Babylonian kings and their divine right to rule. Another important myth in Sumerian mythology was the story of Gilgamesh, the legendary king of Uruk. The Epic of Gilgamesh is one of the oldest surviving works of literature in the world, and it tells the story of Gilgamesh's journey to find immortality. Along the way, he faces many challenges and encounters various gods and goddesses. The Sumerians also had myths about their gods and goddesses. For example, the myth of Inanna's descent to the underworld tells the story of how Inanna, the goddess of love and war, travels to the underworld to visit her sister Ereshkigal. Along the way, she faces many challenges and is eventually killed by Ereshkigal. However, with the help of Enki, she is able to return to the world of the living. The Sumerians believed that the myths were not just stories, but were real events that had taken place in the distant past. They believed that the gods and goddesses had once lived among them and had played an active role in their lives. They felt a strong connection to the gods and goddesses, and they believed that by worshipping and honoring them, they could ensure their own well-being. Religious Practices Religion was central to Sumerian society, and it was practiced on a daily basis. The Sumerians believed that the gods and goddesses had to be appeased and honored through offerings, sacrifices, and rituals. 
Each city had its own temple dedicated to a specific god or goddess, and the priests were responsible for carrying out the religious ceremonies. The temples were also centers of economic and political power, and the priests played an important role in the administration of the city. Offerings and sacrifices were made to the gods and goddesses on a regular basis. These offerings included food, drink, and animals, and they were meant to show respect and gratitude to the gods. Sacrifices were also made during important ceremonies and festivals, such as the New Year Festival. Rituals were an important part of Sumerian religion, and they were used to communicate with the gods and goddesses. One of the most important rituals was the divination ritual, which was used to predict the future. The priests would use various methods, such as interpreting the flight patterns of birds or the entrails of animals, to gain insight into the future. The religion and mythology of ancient Sumer played a central role in their society, politics, and daily lives. The Sumerian pantheon of gods was vast and complex, and it evolved over time as the Sumerians encountered other cultures and assimilated their beliefs. The myths were used to explain natural phenomena and the origins of the gods and the world. Religious practices, such as offerings, sacrifices, and rituals, were carried out on a daily basis to appease and honor the gods. The Sumerians felt a strong connection to their gods and goddesses, and they believed that by worshipping and honoring them, they could ensure their own well-being.